Greetings folks, this video is all about the C4 Evo 6 channel uh, lithium iron and, and nickel metal hydride charger. It looks like a very useful little charger because you can charge the uh, 18650 cells that way or the uh, AA and AAA nickel metal hydride cells that way. Uh, plenty of plug-in chargers uh, that plug into the balance port of the battery but uh, yeah not so many of these um, cylindrical cell chargers very very useful comes in a box like that get a USB-C connection cable uh, to power it there a little cooling fan there let's just pull this plastic off so we get a nice view very very simple operation all you do is plug it in So push the button in the middle to get the setup here. We've got volume, completion tone, backlight. Now I want to turn down the light so we can see a little bit better. Maybe we can get away, get away with uh, doing it that way. There we go. Theme is bright or dark. Oh, look at that. That looks clearer. All right, we'll look at it this way. Capacity limitation, on or off, activation charge, off or on, cycle display, screensaver, language, system info, which languages, oh, all the languages, that's good. There's the firmware version. Alright, so all we do now is basically put in a battery and it starts doing its work. There's a couple of 18650s. Now it'll beep like that for five seconds. Uh, if you don't do anything for five seconds, it will start charging with whatever has been preset. So there, these are almost fully charged. We can look at each one of these. We get this graph uh, heading up towards the fully charged mark. Look at what's happening. 4.17 volts, 1.93 amp charging current. How many milliamp hours have been put in? the charging time and we get a little bit of a graph of the voltage as well back out of that go down to the other one same sort of thing very very simple very useful what i might do is just keep it charging see what happens when they are fully charged also get the manual here 36 watts double a triple a and all the different battery sizes up to 26700 uh, NIMH, NIZN, lithium iron, lithium ferrite, LIHV, uh, operating voltage range 5 to 12 volts, charging current range 0.1 to 3 amps, discharge current range 0.1 to 1.5 amps. It can charge discharge, storage level, destroy, cycle, activate, and analyze. Uh, destroy, I guess, destroy would be a total discharge, which is useful setting if your battery is uh, heating up or just not working properly has a, a polarity reversal warning which is very good internal measurement internal resistance measurement must be pretty close to being fully charged just noticed while it's charging it, it uh, cycles between the display for this battery to the display for the other battery every 15 seconds i think it is but you can set that in the setup see this uh, green indicator here shows that it's the top battery that's being shown and we've just switched to the bottom battery there now we're up to 4.2 volts so it should be telling us they're fully charged soon but anyway let's have a look at the oh, actually let's just put one in the wrong way around let's be devils see what happens oh reverse polarity there you go that's good to know now i have some double a uh, nickel metal hydrides they go that way nice little indicator there of the level of charge automatically selecting the correct 
battery chemistry. There we go. So they're all charging now. So there we go, in pushing the center button there, we get the internal resistance, voltage, temperature. And that is for that battery there. Let's switch to another one. There we go. This one has a higher internal resistance, so maybe that's getting worn out. So there we go from ISDT, the C4 Evo 6 channel, they're calling it, charger for all different sorts of batteries in the cylindrical uh, style. Very, very useful. Don't get many that can do 18650s and double A's of different uh, chemistry. Very nice. I'll be using that one. Thanks for watching.